Alrighty guys, let me just start this video by saying sorry for being away for a couple of months. Um, there's a little thing, it's called hunting season. So, any spare time I had over the last, you know, two, three months, pretty much I was sitting in a tree. Um, luckily, hunting season's over. We're back to fishing. We're back to a lot of videos. And I got a couple of things I want to show you guys. The biggie is this new rod, guys. 10 foot, 2 weight. 10 foot, 2 weight. That's right. Really light, really long nymphing rod. Um, we're going to be able to dominate some trout. So hopefully we can do good with that today, guys. And then I got this new tripod for the other camera. And then, of course, what's filming right now is the new GoPro. So, got some new things for the channel. Should make some better quality videos for you guys. So, look forward to that. It's a chilly day, guys. It's probably like 35 degrees. A little windy. It's cold. But guess what? These are wild brown trout. They don't care. So, really excited to be back fishing. Really excited to get you guys another video. I appreciate the support. So, if you guys are just getting to this channel, feel free to hit subscribe. I know there hasn't been any recent videos, but from here forward, all through 2020, a lot of fishing. So let me get my stuff on guys. Let's get in the water. Let's catch some fish. Let's go. Alrighty guys, still trying to mess with this new GoPro and figure it out. It's kind of scaring me. It doesn't really turn on too quick. I don't know. We'll just keep trying to use it. And then when I was looking at the video from the back of the camera, it looked kind of fuzzy. So I hope this is coming out good. But anyways, screw it, we're here guys. We're at the first spot. I'm gonna show you what flies we put on as well, but let me just show you here. Pool number one, guys, it's a good one. So we're gonna start here. We skipped a lot of the, you know, medium section that can be good, can be bad. So we only got like three hours today, guys. We're gonna get right into it, right in this hole. Got the tripod, I'm gonna get that set up. So you guys have a couple of angles. And uh, let me just show you these flies here quick too. Alright guys, no fish so far, been moving pretty quick, just hitting a couple good spots, trying to skip a lot of that, you know, faster water to get up into some of these bigger pools where the fish spend the winter. So here's one of them, unfortunately this one is so big, the fish that are in here spook so easy, but we'll give it a shot guys, just want to give you a little update, no fish so far, no bites, but uh, we're just at, just starting. It's been a while guys, been three months. Just starting to get into some good water. So, keep going upstream guys. Quite an adventure today. I hope you enjoy it. It's cold, the water is 32 degrees, but we're gonna get some fish today guys. Let's keep working our way upstream, find a couple. Alrighty guys, sorry for this really weird camera angle. Um, I just don't feel like turning the tripod on because I want to keep the fish in the water. Let me show you him quick and we'll get him back. Wild brown trout. Pretty cool. 
looks like he got hit by a bird, but nice fish. All right guys, whenever you're out fishing on a stream and you're doing well and you're catching fish, you get excited. Always take a break, calm back down, relax. I got going here, I caught a fish, you know, I'm out filming again for you guys, all is well. Took that cast up there into that nice calm side pocket. And I, guys, I don't even wanna tell you how big the fish was. You can see him through this clear water. Not on the action camera, but you can see him if you're me. Guys, the biggest fish I've ever hooked in this stream. And I'm way too excited and everything's going well. And I just, I, I, you know, we're not bass fishing, guys. We're on a small creek for trout. And I set the hook too hard and broke them off. Lost both flies. Stinks, guys. Just, just use my mistake to your advantage. Every day, you know, you're out there and you kind of feel yourself really getting going and things are really rocking and rolling and doing good, take a break. But we'll retie on, see if we can go catch a trout in here that has two flies in its mouth. I feel horrible because the fly is probably stuck in the fish. Just makes me sick. But uh, let's retie, get back in there and maybe pull a miracle and catch our flies back. Let's give it a shot. Huge fish, guys, huge fish. Big fish, big fish, big fish, big fish.
Wow guys, wow guys, didn't know I was going to get one that big today, my hands are freezing, let's go guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video, let me tell you, it's a good one, smash that subscribe button if you're new to the channel guys, we're going to be doing stuff like this all the time, and it's winter, imagine what we're going to do in the spring. So, real big fish, he took the dropper. I'll show you guys the fly. Actually, the last two fish came on the same fly. So I'll show you that, guys. Forgot to stop my other camera. Probably just drained all the battery. Alrighty, there's that. Um, I'll show you guys the fly. It's, um, it's certainly no mainstream pattern. It's basically something I just make up. It's like a waltz worm but instead of the whole thing being gray, it's like a golden stonefly color. And then I use an ice sparkle dub as the collar. Just a real flashy, colorful, small nymph type thing, I guess. But I'll show you that guys here in a second. And uh, I think we'll go hit another pool or two. It's getting pretty late. So I'll show you guys the fly and we'll get back in there. See if we can get an even bigger fish I have seen 20 inch fish in here, so we'll keep fishing, guys. Hope you're enjoying it. Alrighty, guys. Whew, check that out. That's a fun hike when it's 30 degrees and the leaves are ice glazed leaves. It's like a leaf ice, rating, ice skating rink. But, uh, guys, it's pretty late. It's later than I thought. It's gonna be dark soon. It's hard to tell when you're in this huge valley because all of a sudden you have light and it's gone. So, we're actually gonna be done for the day. I hope you enjoyed the video. I love the new rod, guys. Look at this thing. Check this thing out. Got the little emblem. Cheap little reel on it. I mean, you don't need much, guys. It's nice to be able to afford the expensive equipment, guys. I'm out here in a sweatshirt and cheap waders and, you know, less than $300 rod, and I catch fish. So don't be, uh, you know, don't lose confidence if your gear doesn't say, you know, Orvis or Sage or something. So just keep it real, guys. Just enjoy fishing. I hope you enjoyed the video. Love the new rod. I hope you guys enjoy the new video. Kick off the new year on a good note. So we'll be out here again soon. Like I said, hunting season's finally done. So it's just green light from here on out for fishing. If I have time, we're going to be fishing, guys. So hope you like the video. And I'll see you guys soon. If you guys want to leave a comment on anything, any type of suggestions, if you guys want to see me fish this stream, you know, designated day to come here and just fish streamers or, you know, use different flies or different techniques, or if you have any advice, if you guys see any mistakes I'm making, leave a comment. But uh, I'll see you again soon, guys. We'll be out there. Appreciate you guys watching. And always, I'll see you in the next video.